University of Minnesota Equine Center has a new facility, the Leatherdale Equine Center, that opened in 2007. It's built to be very horse friendly and it was built by architects that were very familiar with horses. So we have a wonderful area to bring horses in and unload them. We've got a covered unloading area where we can close gates if needed and the horses can be unloaded safely. We have a very wide open look to our hallways. We have a staff that's there 24 hours a day, hourly, monitoring the patients to ensure that they get care. We have a team approach to all of our patient care so that there is a, a senior faculty that leads the team and they involve specialists from a variety of areas if need be. Our internal medicine specialists provide diagnostics and expertise in a wide variety of disorders, from dental disorders to neonatal intensive care to colic and many, many more diseases. We also have reproduction specialists to diagnose and treat infertility, perform embryo transfer, and ship fresh and frozen semen. We have some of the most sophisticated state-of-the-art tools in order to be able to work with our patients and identify exactly what's wrong with them. So one of the focuses of the clinical work that we do at the Piper Performance Clinic is lameness. We have digital radiography. If that doesn't identify the problem, we have a bone scan. And we can also get an incredibly detailed image of the lower limb of the horse using our MRI, or magnetic resonance imaging, a technique that's very commonly used now in humans. In order to get the best view of a joint, we use arthroscopic surgery. The Aquapacer is an underwater treadmill. We use that for our patients to build muscle strength. It increases their flexibility and it helps to train them to get a normal gait again and a stronger gait so we can get them back into riding. The force plate and gait analysis system are used both for a clinical program as well as for research. They help to evaluate every joint and every angle as the horse is walking and trotting using reflective markers and LED lights and high-speed cameras. There's also a force plate in the floor that detects the weight that the horse places on the ground. We have a high-speed treadmill, and we can exercise horses on the high-speed treadmill, and we can place a video endoscope up their nose, Velcro that to their halter, and then watch every breath and every swallow that they take. So we have some of the most sophisticated diagnostic equipment of any veterinary school in the country. Our surgical specialists are board certified and they've had a great deal more training in surgical procedures than one would get in practice and have an amazing amount of tools that are available to them to work on the most complex cases. 